Hi everyone, welcome to Gnan Cloud Garage. In this session, I'm going to talk about two key points. One is what is included in the HPE compute management portfolio and followed by what devices are supported by the HPE OneView 8 series. Okay, so let's start with the first question. So normally the HPE compute management portfolio have some key advantages. One main advantage is optimize server management solutions to address a variety of customer requirements. For example, normally we have a servers in a different server form factors. Like we have a server tower server model and rack mount servers and blade servers. Most of the production environment, we use rack servers and blade servers. Even within the blade also, there are better blade servers. We call it as a composite servers or converged servers. And we can also, one example within the HPE, what is the better blade server name is HPE Synergy. Okay, and if you want to manage a individual server or individual blade or individual specific blade chassis compute node, we require a HPE ILO to connect to the server remotely. ILO means integrated light sort. So this ILO is like a embedded that means we have a ILO port inserted in every of the, every rack mount server and also the compute node servers using that ILO port, we can access the servers remotely wherever it is. Let's say the server is located in US, we can also access from the other countries like India, we can access, we can access from the Europe locations, okay? That is the importance of ILO. And OneView, the HPE OneView, the main advantage of OneView is, let's say we have hundreds of servers. To manage, all the hundreds of servers centrally, we need a one tool, that tool name called centrally management IT infrastructure tool name called HPE OneView. And this tool is mainly located in our on-premises data centers. And another compute management portfolio tool is HPE GreenLake, GL means GreenLake, pay as you go model and HP GreenLake for compute ops management. And this is mainly for edge to cloud environments. So, and this is also available as a SaaS platform, software as a service, okay? So in other words, HP ILO means embedded server management that enables customers to securely configure monitor and update HPE servers. If you want to see the HPE ILO console, uh, for, uh, let me log into our lab system and, and I will show you how the HPE ILO looks like. For example, I am trying to open one of the ILO console. Let's pick the ILO IP address and launch it. You can open your ILO console. So let's say we have a ILO console here and the, here within the ILO console, we have a, some management options. And the, as we discussed, we can also monitor the server status. So server status is just open the console. We have multiple types of consoles available. We can use HTML5 or .NET console or Java Web Start console or wake up monitor. For example, I select as a HTML5 console. From this server, from this uh, HTML5 console, we can see the server status, okay? And we can also monitor the server status from the information tab. And we can also see the information, the complete system information, health status, everything is okay. In case of any issues, there will be a warning messages. It will show in a yellow color. And if there are any errors, the color is represented with a red color. Okay, and if you want to export the log files, even the log files we can export, go to the information section. And most of the time we can review the logs using ILO event log and integrated management log. And sometime our HPA tech support team will ask for a export the ILO log bundle and send it them for a further analysis. During that time, we can use the log bundle using this tab, active health system log. So in short form, we call it as AHS log. So select the AHS log and choose your respective timestamps. Uh, by default, it's selected for a few days. So based on your issue dates or timestamp, you can choose the from one to dates. And finally, you can use the download option so that this log will be downloaded. 
okay and if you enter the specific case number and all it will automatically send the log information to the respective technical persons as well okay so this is a quick overview of ilo console this ilo console is same for all type of servers rack mount servers and also the blade servers okay now another point is hp one view as i mentioned hp one view also infrastructure management but the only the importance of hp one view is centrally manage all the servers within one single console and soft this software that provides composable solutions composable solution means hp synergy frame is the one of the composable solution and across compute not only the compute it will also support for your storage and networking and even this hp one view have a some integration capability to the third party solutions using rest api we can also use some management plugins to integrate with the vcenter server v relays operations manager and also the other hypervisor vendors okay and the console is looks like this if you want to see let me quickly log into our lab system and we can see the how the hp one view console so let's say if you see the HP one view, this is the HP one view console. Let's select the dashboard. You can see within the dashboard, we can review the server profiles and server hardware. Currently nine server hardware available. And what is the profile maintenance status? Currently no server in the maintenance, all in the active state. The complete blade, uh, blade base, if you have multiple blade servers, you can also see all the information within the one view. Okay, that is the importance of one view dashboard to see the specific server hardware how many hardware currently nine servers added in our lab system so currently these nine servers we can see the ilo consoles we can also monitor every information suppose if i select esxa3 we can see the overview and also the specific hardware information and we can also review the port storage utilization remote support all the information we can also view from the one view console okay and one view currently we have the latest version is 8 series version very latest version 8.4 okay maybe in future we may expect the other extension versions okay so let's back to the slide and hp green lake for compute ops management this is all like a life cycle management for all servers from edge to cloud platform and deliver as a secure software as a service application continuously managed and improved by hp why can improved by hp means hp recently launched another product called hpe pce provide cloud enterprise even if you notice the hpe provide cloud enterprise console within that console one of the uh, tab or tile includes the hp green lake compute ops management okay and the console is looks like this currently i do not have access to this but you can explore from the internet you can see the sample consoles for the hp green lake for compute ops management okay and now when it comes to the ilo and specifically to the one view there is a specific supported devices like uh, compute storage and networking and also the composable solution these solutions what are all the devices supported by hp one view i will explain in the following slide if you now the key question is what devices are supported by hp one view 8.x and the latest version 8.4 and with let's talk about within the compute let's say within the compute it's supported for hp synergy and the current frames are HP Synergy 12,000 Synergy frame. And the Synergy frame looks like this. It consists of multiple compute node and also it have a storage shelf and it also have a, uh, also have a virtual image appliances, image streamers also running okay and it is also supported for rack mount servers within the hp dl series xl dx and ml series and one example is hp dl 380 gen 10 or gen 11 servers and it will also supported for micro server and sd super dome flex servers also it supported this hp one view and when it comes to the storage, we have a different models of HP storage models. HP 3 power, HP Primera, Nimble Storage, Alatra. Even Alatra have different models like 5K, 6K, and 
9k models and supported for sans switches as well and one view supported for network device also specifically to the hpe virtual connect and also the other networking aruba networking devices and specifically to the hyper converged infrastructure the hpe uh, official tool is hpe simplicity simplicity also can manage from hpe one view tool and when it comes to the hybrid cloud solutions that hybrid cloud solution name called hpe azure stack this hp azure stack hca also can monitor and manage from the hp one view console okay so hope you got an idea what are all the main hp compute management portfolio and what are all the key supported compute storage networking hyper convergent hybrid cloud devices okay so that's it for today thank you for your time today and if you are watching this video first time please do view like share and subscribe to the gnan cloud garage channel and if you are already subscribe i appreciate all your support bye for now